Oh boy. Typhoon are coming. Let's just hope it's not a major rain and windy event. I don't want the alarms going off signaling a flood like what happened last year. <laughs> Before we get into this week's vlog, I want to make a brief announcement. I, you guys might have heard of the uh, channel Math Shumato Arena Berry, or basically it's a husband wife duo, Matthew and uh, Rena. They uh, went to the Hanami this year. They're very friendly, very, uh, very, very helpful people. They uh, had a little bit of trouble with their YouTube channel. It was deleted, and uh, well, they just uh, they made a new channel. I don't know why it was deleted. They didn't break any rule from like last I heard. So uh, you guys, go to their channel, give them some help, see what you can do to help them because uh, they didn't deserve it. It's kind of shitty that YouTube doesn't really care about small creators, even though we're pretty much the bread and butter of the, uh, you know, the YouTube game. So, please go check out their new channel and uh, subscribe to them, and uh, make sure that uh, you have the bell turned on for their channel as well. They make some quality content. So, uh, yeah, Mashu Maru Rina Berry is their channel name. So, yeah, link down below in the description. All right, that's it. The vlogs. <laughs> It's well after 11 a, uh, in the evening. I've been, uh, been working till 11 this whole week. I've been so busy and I'm so tired, but you know what? I can't wait to show you guys what I'm doing. Sun burnt like all hell. What is going on down below me? I'm hanging out in Shio Dome today before I got a meeting at 3. What is going on? I think they have a Winter Olympics thing set up over here. I have not filmed much for the vlog this week, and I also made a separate beach vlog. That's because uh, I've been pretty busy. I'm also really red because I got sunburnt. I'm so tired. I just haven't had much sleep at all the last few days, but uh, I'm hoping once all this uh, stuff that I'm working on is done and I can actually tell you about what I'm doing, it'll, it'll, it'll be worth it. I, I'm not hoping. I know it's going to be worth it, but it's just a lot of effort, a lot of... Uh, a lot of time, haven't had much time to focus on myself and focus on video editing and stuff, but this weekend at the beach was really good, so the uh, stuff behind me right there. Yeah. <laughs> Monday. I hate Mondays. I'm so tired. And white balance. White balance out the ass. There we go. <laughs> Hanging out with Tommy tonight. <laughs> we uh, got some Singaporean chicken and rice. This stuff looks so good. This is a really well prepared piece of chicken. So there's chili and some sauce in here, and then with the rice. Oh god. There's a bone. Has it? I didn't know there was a bone. I was choking for a second. That's why I was doing this. Are you still filming? In principle, it's not bad. The chicken tastes good, the sauces are good, the rice is great, the soup is great. But I don't understand why there's just so much bone in this chicken. Like a couple of these pieces, it's just straight bone. There's very little 
to no meat. So I did a little bit of uh, searching online and it turns out that that's actually how it's normally prepared in Singapore. Now, I didn't know that because last week on Wednesday, uh, I went to a, uh, like a food vendor on a, like a food truck near my office and I had Singapore chicken and rice, the same dish, but without the bones. So I expected this to be boneless as well. So I took that first bite expecting it to be you know, nice succulent chicken. I ended up choking on bone, that's what she said. Ami over here is just laughing. She, yeah. Oh, she just bit into a bone. <laughs> that wasn't bad. That dog's cute. <laughs> yeah, the restaurant is right over there. The price was pretty good too. It was like a thousand yen. Not bad at all. It's just weird. I didn't expect to have the bone in there. That's what she said. Damn it. <laughs> I didn't know this building was over here. It's a, a very famous piece of uh, architecture here in downtown Tokyo. This is actually nearby Ginza. It's called the Capsule Tower. It looks like it's under uh, disrepair. They uh, put up some sort of netting around it. And I guess they're repainting it or something. I don't know. And the building's open still, so, but. It looks pretty cool though, doesn't it? It's typhooning pretty bad out there. These are just the rain bands too. I'm a little bit worried about getting home tonight. <laughs> At least this is coming along quite nicely. Doesn't look good right now, not at all, but uh, the door to a new opportunity. I've had another busy week and a typhoon coming right now does not help me. <laughs> But yeah, it's, it's been a good week. I haven't really been able to film that much because of how busy I've been. But uh, a lot of good things are happening and you'll see those soon. Hopefully sooner rather than later. I just gotta, gotta keep working at it. But I'm gonna go home, edit this vlog. But actually, you know what? I need to get something to eat. Now, I had a big lunch today. Let me show you it right here next to me. I went to a Brazilian place in Ginza with the, uh, some of the people from Ginza Hub. The co-working space there. That was too much food. There goes my diet, my gains. <laughs> so I'm gonna get something simple at the uh, supermarket. I take bachelor food to a whole new level. This just screams I'm 26 and I have no girlfriend. It's not like I want it to change. I mean, pretty happy with my life. So, no need to uh, force things that are uh, not really something I need, to, I need to worry about in life. Too many people in my, fr my friends, they're like, oh my god, I, I don't have a boyfriend. I don't have a girlfriend. What do I do? Just enjoy your life, man. Wow. Mm. Alright, well, now show up, I'll